Hello calculus students. In this problem we're going to use the mean value theorem to estimate the um, values of a function over an interval. Um, actually it's going to be a difference of values of a function uh, over an interval. So um, remember that the statement of the mean value theorem says that if f is continuous on the closed interval um, then there exists a point in the open interval where the um, derivative and uh, at that point is equal to the average rate of change of the function over that interval. So that looks like this. Okay, so here's the mean value theorem. Um, this is the formula um, version of it. Um, I left the conditions up here. So um, what this is implying then is that there exists some point C on this interval, 2 to 5, where um, the derivative is equal to this average rate of change. So uh, let's simplify that a little bit. Um, the 5 minus 2 is 3. Now we don't know what f of 5 minus f of 2 is. Um, that's what we're trying to estimate. So um, in order to estimate that, um, we'll use this condition up here that um, f prime of x is between minus 2 and 2 for all x um, in the interval from 2 to 5. So for that c that exists in 2 to 5, <clears throat> um, it is certainly the case that um, if f prime is equal to this quantity here, then the fact that f prime of x is between minus 2 and 2, then certainly f prime of c for any c then is between minus 2 and 2. And since f prime of c is equal to this quantity, we just substitute f prime of x with this quantity up here. All right, and then um, now it's just a little bit of algebra. Uh, we multiply both sides of the inequality by a positive 3, so that does not change the order of the inequality. 3 times minus 2 is minus 6, 3 times 2 is 6, and you get that the um, estimate of this f of 5 minus f of 2 is between minus 6 and 6, and that is the solution to the problem. All right, good luck.